Uh-oh, tonight a huge swarm of zombies is coming! Oh no! All right, let's create seven zombie security systems to protect our house. Seven security measures should be enough to save us! To start, let's build our first security measure here. We can turn this into a protective layer of security lava. First, security lava. We'll just dig a trench around it, like this. Okay, I'll follow your lead. Yeah, three spaces wide. Then, we'll fill it up with lava. We got this! This looks good. Now it's time to pour the lava in. Nice job, JJ! Even if the zombie swarm attacks, there's no way they can cross the lava, so we'll be safe. The zombies won't even be able to get close to our house with all this lava in the way. Is that enough? Not quite. Just to be safe, we're gonna make seven security measures. Huh? Seven? For the second one, we'll build a barricade here, behind the front door, just in case the zombies break it down. Second, barricade. Barricade? Yep, that's right. Since our door is made of wood, it might be easy for the zombies to break it down. Yep, that's why I'm doing this. Hmm? It's another security measure. I'm wiring it together, like so. Next, I'll put a wall of iron bars on top. Oh! There we go. Now I'll put some pistons up here as well. Some more iron bars. Some more redstone. Zombies can't break iron bars very well. Yeah, that's why the zombies will have a tough time getting inside. I'll place a lever right here. And then the last thing to do is fill in the rest of the floor, like this. Oh! In the event that the zombies break down the door, we can pull this lever. Whoa! Cool! Now that's a barricade! Now we don't have to worry about the zombies getting inside our house at all! Even if they break down the wooden door, they can't break through iron bars! Yep, we're definitely safe now! The second one is done! If the zombies manage to break through the barricade, our third security measure will be a secret passage! Third, a secret passage! A secret passage? Awesome! Yep, now we'll dig our way through. Let's go really deep. Mm -hmm. It might be easier to make our secret passage with the help of some TNT. Ooh. And when we blow it up, huh? it'll make our secret passage. Oh. Is it that easy? Let's do this. All right. Three, two, one. Easy peasy. Yeah! Okay, time to clean this up. Let's get started. Our tunnel is complete. Yay! Now in the event of zombies breaking into the house, we can escape through here. But JJ, we already have security lava and a barricade, so I really don't think they'll be able to break into the house. Even though it's unlikely, they still might be able to break through. In that case, we need to be sure to be as secure as possible. There's something I want to build. Hmm? What is it? I'll start by digging this out. What are you making, JJ? There's a super important device we still need. I'm setting this up. There we go. Just like that. Now then... I'll connect this here. Almost finished. Great! I'll put some repeaters here. Now it all connects. What is it, JJ? I'm making a super important device right now, Mikey. I just need to hook this up and place a few more repeaters here. Like this. That should do it. Awesome! What does it do? All right. Good. It's all coming together. This goes on top. Huh? Okay. Hmm. What could it be? I have no idea. Sweet! Check it out! What is this thing? I'll place blocks around the edge. Hmm. Then I'll power it all up. But first, I need to put the power source here, just like this. 
And then I'll connect that over here. This will lead all the way outside. Ooh. Okay, Mikey. Right here, I'm placing a button on the wall. Huh? I wonder what that's for. I'll lead this redstone around to the front of the house and connect it over there. Perfect. Bit of this. Bit of that. Almost done. I need to connect it up here. There. That should work. Okay, Mikey. It's all done. I just need to fix up this last part. And just like that. The next device is ready to go. It doesn't look any different, though. Here's the deal about this device. Huh? If zombies manage to break through the barricade, we can push this button. Wow! Amazing! What is that? It's a secret entrance. That's super cool! Yep. We'll be safe in here if the zombies break in. Sweet! This is incredible! Now, let's build our fourth security measure inside the secret passage. Our fourth one? We're gonna go through this hallway and load it up with lasers. Fourth, lasers. All right, got it! We're gonna place a bunch of lasers to make sure the zombies can't get through! Yep, just like this. Cool! <laughs> Let's set up the lasers. Let's do this thing! Woohoo! Like this. Nice! We're connecting the lasers to stop the zombies from getting through. There, that's good. Mm -hmm. Sweet. Okay, I'll put another one down. There. Whoa, nice job. Excellent. There's no way the zombies will make it through all these lasers. Next, let's build a basement in the back. Great idea. We'll enter it by dropping down from above. That sounds awesome. I'll use a command to make a passage that leads down. And with this... Whoa! Hey, it worked! Epic! Afterward, we'll have to make sure it's safe for us to jump down. We can reduce the fall damage with hay bales. Good thinking! This will prevent fall damage, so it should be safe. I'll try it! Woohoo! <laughs> Okay, then from here, let's make another passage. There's something I want to put in a room down here. I'll use a command again to create a space. And just like this, I made a hallway. Now I'll make a nice big room here. A nice big room? There's something I want to put in here. Huh? Like what? There, the big room is ready to go. Wow, that was fast. All right, Mikey. If the zombies make it this far, there's something else I want to build in here. What is it? Let's make arrow turrets. Fifth, arrow turrets. You mean something that shoots arrows out of it? Yeah. How do you make that? We'll launch a swarm of arrows at the zombies. Ooh. It works like this. Make sure everything is connected, then give it a lever. Then, inside the device, I'll add a bunch of arrows. Wow! Impressive! Just like this. So far, so good. There! I filled the dispensers. Cool! So if the zombies manage to get this far, we can turn on the device. Wow! That's powerful! That should hold the zombies back. We can fight whole hordes of zombies with this! Great work, JJ! feel way safer with all this extra security we added. But Mikey, what if the zombies manage to break through all our security systems? We should build an emergency escape. Sixth, emergency escape. Now then, I'm gonna dig back here. For this emergency escape tunnel, I plan on using some TNT. Blast it wide open! I'm gonna load it up with as much TNT as I can, just like this. That's plenty of TNT. All right. Three, two, one. Wow! That's awesome! Whoa! Woo -hoo -hoo. That tunnel was easy! You can 
say that again. Let's clean it up. Okay, I'll help! This is number six, our emergency escape. We're making it just in case we need it. Mm -hmm. Nice! Hey, JJ, what kind of emergency escape device will we make? We're gonna set it up to take us straight to the surface using rails and minecarts. Rails and minecarts? That's the idea. We'll place the rails right here. This way, it will be an emergency escape device. Yeah? That goes super fast. Amazing! Now let's connect these rails. Yeah! I'll hook this up. Mm-hmm! And our emergency escape device is complete, Mikey! Oh, wow! We did it! We can use this to escape to the surface, right? Yep, let's try riding it. You go first. Sure! Thank you! Okay, JJ, I'm gonna escape now! Three, two, one! Whoa! Whoa! This is awesome! I'm going for a ride! Try it out! Whoa! Ho -ho! So much fun! This is really fast! Whoa! Whoa! You made it, JJ! Nice! Now, even in the unlikely event that zombies invade our base, we can escape to the outside! Let's use it to run away to the surface! But, JJ, running away is useful and everything, but what will we do about the swarm of zombies that break inside? Hmm. Well, let's prepare our seventh security measure. What is it? After using the emergency railway we just tested, we'll set off a powerful explosion! Seventh, self-destruct mechanism. Okay, I'm getting it set up. <laughs> the rails are ready. I'll put the lever right here. Uh-huh. Now we can switch directions. Oh! Then up here... I'll leave a button. And here, I'll leave a TNT minecart. TNT minecarts have TNT that can explode, right? But one single TNT minecart won't be enough to blow up very many zombies, JJ. Yeah, you're right, but you can take TNT minecarts and stack as many as you want in the same place. Look! Seriously? All right, let's stack a crazy number of TNT minecarts and leave them for later. You're using a ton of minecarts! That'll make for a humongous explosion! Okay, it's done, Mikey. The self-destruct device is complete. Awesome! That'll definitely take care of all the zombies. Now let's wait until night. Check it out. It's nighttime. We put on our diamond equipment to prepare for the zombies. And we even have golden apples to recover health with. Wow, we're really prepared, Mikey. We got this. Definitely. <gasps> oh no! JJ, look! Zombies! We're surrounded by zombies! Ah! No kidding! There's a horde of zombies pouring in! Oh! <laughs> oh, there's nothing to worry about, JJ! We have security lava right here, so the zombies can't even get across! See? They'll fall right into the security lava! Check it out! It fell right into the lava! Whoa! Mikey! The zombies are burning up! <laughs> this is easy! Whoa! There are a lot of them, but at this rate, we'll be fine! We're totally gonna survive! Huh? Uh, hold on, Mikey. Are the zombies getting closer? Huh? I think they are! That's not good! Why aren't they dying? What? No, oh, Mikey! The zombies made it through! How? There's no way! They're coming! Eat your golden apples! Yikes! There are so many! Ugh, Mikey, we're in trouble! How did this happen? Who'd have thought they could walk over lava? No! You've gotta be kidding me! A retreat! Into the house! Run away! Turn on the barricade! Right! Three, two, one! Ew. Now we can relax! Yep, we should be safe now, Mikey. It looks like we're gonna be okay. Uh, hang on a sec. Huh? Uh-oh, the zombies destroyed our wooden door. It's fine, JJ. Look, it doesn't look like they can break through iron bars. Piece of cake. 
Oh, I think you're right. Huh? Ah! Uh, wait, that's not good. They're breaking the glass. Oh, did we really forget to barricade the windows? This is bad. Ah! Ah, the zombies are breaking more glass. Ah! They're climbing inside. Oh, there's so many of them. Can we fight them off? There are too many, JJ. Let's try the secret passage. Run away! Hurry, Mikey! Okay! It's open! Get in! All right! I made it! Good luck, JJ! Come on, come on! Quick! We got away, Mikey! That's good! It looks like we can relax in here for a bit! Huh? Oh no! They're breaking through the secret entrance, Mikey! Oh. Get to the back! The zombies are getting in! Carefully! Try not to hit the lasers, Mikey. Run away! Hang on, the zombies... Huh? They're getting through the lasers! Ah! The zombies! They're pushing past the lasers? Ah! Come on, Mikey! Oh no! Oh no! The lasers aren't working on them! I know! Get underground! Down here? Hurry! Whoa! We made it! Okay, Mikey. Let's activate our aero security measure to stop the zombies. Yeah! Whoa! Oh, wow! It's working! They're falling one after the other! I think we'll survive this! Me too! Security arrows are amazing! They're the best! We can stop as many zombies as we need to! You're right! This is a piece of cake! Yep! See? They keep falling! Hmm? Bad news, we ran out of arrows! <gasps> we have no choice but to escape! To the minecart! Uh... Hurry! Okay! Three, two, one! The zombie swarm is coming! Uh... I'm getting out of here, too! Oh! That was close! Those zombies almost took me out! Phew! They broke through our security way too easily! We'll be all right. It's time to launch our huge number of TNT minecarts at them. Let's do it! Yep, just pull this lever. There. Will it really beat those zombies? We can't know for sure, but we have to try. Three, two, one, launch! Whoa! Whoa! If you enjoyed today's adventure, make sure to like and subscribe. Plus, you can check us out on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok whenever you want with the links in the corner. Thanks for watching. See you next time.